DISD secondary students will be sporting a new accessory when school resumes next month, clear or mesh backpacks. They're one of the latest tools districts are adopting for the sake of safety. It's a part of a larger plan, and I believe that the hope is that, you know, it's one more um, item that can help um, deter um, potential threats and also to ensure safety for our students. Backpacks must be clear or mesh throughout, though the straps can be a solid color. Students can carry in it a non-clear pouch, no larger than five and a half by eight and a half inches, to hold items such as a cell phone, money, and hygiene products. Cannondale ISD in Tarrant County made the same decision. The superintendent says the teachers voiced wide support. But I think our educators just being in a situation where um, they can see, you know, what, what's coming into the building. And, you know, we can see it with our eyes without having to sit there and worry about trying to sit there and search. Just being able to put eyes on something that, you know, uh, simplifies that makes things a whole lot simpler. DISD says clear backpacks are not the only answer to guarantee safety. But with a comprehensive plan in place, including use of additional metal detectors and active shooter trainings, trained monitors, security door checks, and secure vestibules in many schools, they hope it's more than a start. Especially in, you light, in light of the unfortunate e event in Uvalde, um, everyone has stated they, they want us to do everything we certainly can to ensure that their students are safe and to ensure that um, kids are safe when they go to school. The district has already purchased the backpacks and they plan to distribute one free one to each student in grades 6 through 12 before school starts. In Dallas, Brooke Rogers, CBS 11 News.